All right. Good luck, everyone. Good luck. Let's see if we can take this down, huh? We do get the play. This hand is rocky, unfortunately. Um, no white source is kind of rough. We do get to Pelt Collector into Stone Coil Serpent, but uh, not being able to cast this is kind of a ball ache. Um, I think this is just about fine, but it's it's pretty close. Definitely pretty close. No main deck thought seizes is nice. No main deck thought seizes is very, very nice. All right, so we're going to Blooming Marsh into a Pelt Collector here. Off you go. Swamp. We got a Cauldron Familiar. Which is Oven, sure. Drawing the Snake is absurd here. Let's cast that in a heartbeat. Crack. Does have the Kitty Cat. Okay. Would love a white source here. Would love a white source. No white source. Knight of the Bond Legion. In that case, we can... Unfortunately... Well, we can cast this as a 4-4 four, four and make this trample. Or we can just pulse the oven. And I kind of like pulsing the oven to play around claim, to be honest. Need to play around claim the firstborn if we can. Opponent does sack the cat. Get in with beats. Go to 13, off you go. It's tempting there to cast the stone coil to, to grow this, um, but I'm scared to claim the firstborn pretty pretty badly, honestly. Woe Strider, not nice to see either. Do you find a white source? Okay. So we can cast. How do we grow this? We can either aspirant grow this up the hard way and punch through. Or we can. Yeah, okay, I think this is fine. So we shock, we go Knight of the Ebon Legion into Luminarch Aspirant. Move to combat. Put the counters on the pelt collector. Attack for five. Uh, do I make this attack? I don't think so. Pretty sure we just attack with Pelty Boy here. Opponent goes to eight. Knight does grow by two. Goes to being a three four, courtesy of uh, the snake. Dead. We'll keep keep up the good work, shall we? All right, rack sack, rack sack, rack sack. Uh, list is fairly stock, right? Just cat oven. Uh, so yeah, okay. So opponent is on four devil, four priest, dreadhorde butchers. So we kind of want cages. Soul guide is probably a no. I don't think we want this uh, in this particular configuration. Opponents not on. Anything graveyard base but cat. I want baffling end. Uh, I consider shape of sanctuary in this matchup sometimes because of mayhem devil, which is perfectly reasonable. I also consider wilt because of witch's oven, uh, which is another card. Well, also we have to be considerate of um, of uh, sky sovereign. So we do this, we trim on the Thought Seizes, uh, we take away three of the snake effects and the inscription, and we call it good. And we go into game number two. Let's try and keep that up. More of that, please. More of that. Feels like uh, we were correct to pulse that oven. Really shut down what, uh, what K Prince was trying to do.
Hand is kind of awkward with no green again. I do think this is a keep as well. Uh, draw the green source like a champion, because better lucky than good, am I right? Better lucky than good. Boom. No two drop. Okay, uh, so... Expecting threes. Plenty of threes is my expectation. Uh, how much removal am I expecting? Nothing in the main deck. Two abrades, two heartless acts. Very likely to have one of those. Uh, I think I am just leading on Aspirant, so the snake is better next turn. Get this rolling. Opponent does Heartless Act. Interesting they brought those in, even though we uh, are counters. Interesting. Does have the Woe Strider. Does have the Woe Strider. Draw a Blood Chief's Thirst. Can't kick that just yet. Um, how do we want to navigate this? Can't get through this woe strider, which is super frustrating. Uh, it's about finding the best way of, of perusing this board and not playing too much into claim the firstborn. Um, which I think looks like this. Interesting. There's the priest. We have that handled. And we need to handle it. It's a big problem otherwise. Uh, a double claim would suck donkey ass here, obviously, but can't play around that. So. How do sequence... Pretty sure we kill this priest. Abrades the ooze in response. Um, this is fine. We can we can live with this. See how Prince wants to scry. Scry's the top, which is a little frustrating. So we can shock ourselves. Move to combat, declare attack with the Knight of the Ebon Legion. We get in for one. And we just snake here. We just snake here. Gold Familiar is a pretty good one. Hoping not to see an oven in the near future, I'll be honest. Find ourselves another scavenging ooze. Sure. Let's move to combat here. Uh, the fact Giganthor was not put into hand means that he's either drawing a card with Castle most of the time, so... I think, I think this is okay. That's fine. Sure. Mm -hmm. Don't mind where we are currently. It seems seems like a reasonable state to be in. Um, 
So I can pump this, but it was blocked, so there's no point. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Trade off the snake. And then we go knight into ooze. Off you go. Opponent does draw with Castle Locked Wing. Makes a lot of sense. Four cards. Good. Oh, finding the Noxious Grasp is, is pretty dirty. Did not want to see Noxious Grasp. Did not want to see Noxious Grasp. Agadim for two seems pretty good to me. Might even be able to wait on this. So if I Agadine for two, I can get back Ooze, but I can't do it in time to stop this. Alternatively, I can get back Aspirant, start growing my guys. Uh, I think I do this. I think I put Lurus into my hand. Opponent will do the thing they have to have to do. Put the cat in the oven and you shake it all up. One interesting game. Having not seen a single claim the first born is is pretty telling. Unfortunately, opponent correctly uh, pulls back Wolf Strider. We were hoping they were going to cast Gigantha. That is unfortunate. What am I supposed to do here? This happens. That definitely happens. It's cast Lurus. Cast the ooze. Opponent should likely pull the trigger. Yeah. That's fine. I deliberately didn't attack with these knights because uh I didn't want to be forced to pump. My concern was being forced to pump. Which I did not want to have happen. Point will draw more with Castle Lock Twain. Goes to 15. Finds a Woe Strider. That's a pretty good one. Blood Chief's Thirst. Does seem pretty good. What do I do here? So... If I Blood Chief's Thirst, the Woe Strider, I probably don't have to eat it straight away. I think that's what I'm doing. Cast the Aspirant. Opponent does bite on using their oven, which is fine. I'm going to move to combat. They never trade, right? If I can make him trade for Agadims, that'd be pretty great. 
I want to give him the option. Do I? Because I just bring back a f bring back the cat, block with the cat, and bring it back. I don't think I do. I think I just wait. Opponent does sack the cat. We are obviously tapped out, so. Shenanigans are afoot. Sacks the goat. Has to be looking for claim the first pawn. I imagine they found it. This is going over there. No, found the devil. Found the devil. Devil's also very good here. Looks like Luris is going down. That's fine, we have Academes. Correctly killing off the ooze. Devil was pretty big. Devil was pretty big. Does leave Aspirin alive though. Need to break this up. Kinda can't break it up. This is frustrating. Um, Uh, so Scrounger has no fuel. I can pull back ooze and eat this, theoretically. But I lose my Lurus again. This is correct. I think this is correct. It's close though. This is very, very close. Did not want to see that. I need a way of breaking down this devil. The account oven can honestly kind of just stay. I need this to go. Second dagger deems. Okay, well again, this attack is free. And then, I guess I eat Scrap Heap Scrounger. Don't really think I can get through this, unfortunately. The Mayhem Devil just proving to be a bit too much of an issue. This devil, bruh. This devil's been rough. Oh, Midnight Reaper. Oh, dude. That's so good. That's so good. 
think this might be on to game three, unfortunately, chat. First game three of the day. But I don't mind. Um, yeah, this is probably over. Let's move on. Let's move on. Game three it is. Game game tray it is. All right. Does that change my configuration at all? We saw Strider, uh, Gigantha. What else is exiled over here? Uh, I can't find out. All right. Uh, I normally like Shape of Sanctuary in this matchup quite a lot. Uh, but it is definitely only a bit better on on the, uh, what do you call it, on the, the draw, on the play, I don't like it quite so much. So I'm going to trim these away, give myself uh, two mentors back on the play. See how that feels, try a little something, something like that. I will play first. Hands good, we can keep this. Not ideal by any stretch, but we can keep this. We can definitely, definitely keep this. The pulse is very good in this matchup. Tap land, sure. Uh, so this should just be shock for Luminarch Aspirant. And look to set up uh, Snake Effect next turn. This thing being immune to Mayhem Devil is nice, by the way. Obviously it can still get claimed, but... Cannot get pinged down, which is something. Oven's interesting. Does have the cat. Might wait on the pulse. Might be a bit greedy, but I think I wait on the pulse. Just don't want to see Mayhem Devil here. Shit. Did not want to see that one. That's what we were hoping to avoid. I think I just pulsed the devil, right? Priest, sure. Probably also has to go. I hate leaving another one around, but I think I have to. So I blow the priest. Think so. Think it's correct. I think I just have to go around. Puts Giganta in hand. That's not bad. That is not bad. 
and it will bring back the kitty cat. Uh, goes to one. Do I threaten this or do I put this into my hand? I think this is better. Off you go. Think, think we have this. Get in. Four and zero oh with abs and constrictor. Whoo, whoo, buddy.